welcome. In this video, we're going to be looking at a new effect called the Prisma effect. It's perfect for images. So I've just opened up an untitled standard Facebook post. Um, you can either upload your own photos, use one of the Canva photos, doesn't matter as long as it's an image. So I'm going to use a Canva photo. I've got one here of some soup. I'm going to click edit image and scroll down toward the bottom. We have these Prisma options. Now it will do different things depending on the option you choose. So this is a lovely one. If I select Camelcade, it will then change the image to suit this new style of drawing. Hopefully it's taking its time to do this today. Aha, there we go, hit apply. And then you've got this cartoon style drawing. If I go to another page, I'll add the same image and I'll show you a different option for Prisma. Go to see all. What have we got? We've got snowfall, passion fruit, storm, pattern, lizard, kick scooter and tiramisu and one called wind. Let's try wind. These are great if you want to do something different to your imagery rather than just standard images on your design. And again, it's turned it into something slightly different. So we've got two different effects on the same image. I'm going to do one more because I am interested in seeing what pattern does. This looks interesting, so I want to see what this does to the image. Have a play, have a look at these, discover the different things you can do with them. It's called Prisma. You click on your image and scroll down to the bottom and you've got the different options. So pattern is kind of giving it a mosaic look. I think that's lovely. So there you go. That's it for today. Just a brief look at the Prisma options or Prisma feature in Canva.